the last thing that I would say about why it's so wonderful to start your own company, and I see this with all of my entrepreneurs, it's not just the jobs you create, which is wonderful economically, it's the culture you get to create. So if we want to create a business culture in the United States that is more egalitarian, more understanding of what it's like to be a female CEO, not just a male CEO, I think the surest and fastest way to do that is to have more women starting their own companies and becoming CEOs of those companies. If you look at technology, which is an area where I work, and again, it's the Fortune 500 companies that you hear about. And it's true that we still only have about 15% of Fortune 500 companies have women executives. But if you look at two contrasts, both of which are wonderful companies, you look at IBM and Xerox, uh, both companies run by women. But both of those women have been in their respective companies 25 to 35 years, and they are wonderful role models. And you look at two other companies, Yahoo and Google, where you have two C-level women running those companies or being the number two person at Facebook. Those are both companies that have, those women have been in the workforce for less than 25 years. In both cases, they've been in technology for probably less than 15 years. So the fastest way to the top for young women is to go and start a company or go join an entrepreneurial company and have that company grow and surpass and become larger than those big old school companies um, that might be less understanding of the values of female leadership.